I'm going to demonstrate how to nebulize dilute solutions of hydrogen peroxide uh, that we're able to breathe. And this is a very useful technique for killing upper respiratory infections because the peroxide will kill viruses, bacteria, fungi, other infectious organisms like that. And it's very safe. And it's, uh, we've already diluted it and it's in the bag ready to go. So we keep this in the refrigerator between uses. And then when we're ready, we just take a syringe. Everybody receives syringes and attach a needle. And this is just to take the uh, dilute peroxide out of the bag. And then to keep everything uh, clean, we're gonna wipe off the, uh, the bag. So we use the yellow rubber. And we want to be very careful to go in direct and not go through the wall of the tubing because then it, it'll leak. And then we just pull back to two and a half. That's the right dose. We have two and a half in here. <clears throat> and then we're going to put it into the nebulizer itself. So this is the actual nebulizer. And we just take the dilute peroxide and squirt it into the nebulizer. And then we attach it ideally to an oxygen mask like this. And then we can put this around our nose and mouth, so it covers both. And then we just turn on the uh, machine and breathe through our nose and through our mouth. And I'm inhaling and exhaling through at the same time. And it typically takes about 10 minutes for the uh, amount of volume to nebulize. And then when you're done, just take everything off and disassemble everything and wash it out with uh, soap and water and let it dry. And then it's ready to use again. You could use it as often as every hour if you're very, very sick or every two hours or every four hours or once a day or whatever. So that's the procedure for using nebulized hydrogen peroxide.